All righty. So implementation this week was in the CRM, kind of doing some scripting around outbound calling um, when you're working your leads. Uh, so this was built by Ben and Colton, uh, consultant and developers extraordinaire. Um, and yeah, really the, the goal of this implementation was to automate some outbound calling cadences, right? So, you know, we have a 10 step flow at certain points in that flow, we might branch into different pathways, right? So if I call someone and they pick up, I go down path A. If I call them and I and they don't pick up, I might go down path B. And so here, we're essentially using the um, ever useful call result field um, that you can fill in when you close out a call through CRM to decide the appropriate next steps. Um, so this function in particular is essentially saying that if a call result um, is logged as, you know, left voicemail. There's a couple different options that might apply, basically meaning that we didn't reach them at this time. Um, then a function is triggered that will schedule a follow-up. Um, one thing that's kind of cool that the team did with this is that they built in some of the time delays as organization variables. So again, calling back to that creator story, this is the cases where these are really useful. Um, so we have a, an organization variable that defines how many days in the future, or how many weeks, in the future, that follow-up should happen. Um, and that number is used to essentially create a call record scheduled on that future date. Um, the nice thing about it being an org variable is that if our client ever wants to adjust that, right? So let's say that it's three weeks right now, but they decide, you know what, we're calling a little too much. Let's make it five weeks. Um, they can just go into that org variable chip page, change the three to a five, and it's done. They don't need to go into the code editor. They don't need to call us and have us come in and update things. Uh, we're just using this more easily accessible variable to like define things about the cadence of this outreach. Um, so nice implementation. We've done, you know, this type of thing in a lot of different shapes and forms. I kind of wanted to call this one out because of that org variable. It's just a clever way to do it. Um, you know, we're always trying to build solutions that give our client autonomy, right? Where if they want us to come in and, and kind of manage everything, we're happy to do it. Um, but for things like this, it's kind of nice if we can hand them the reins, quick video and say, hey, if you want to adjust any of these, you know, time frames, here they all are, right? They're all notated. You just come right in here, change a three to a four, and now the function works differently. Very nice. Wow, Colton hasn't even been with us a full two weeks yet, and already he's got an implementation of the week. Nice job. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, welcome aboard, to, Colton. Guys. Welcome aboard, Colton. 